Hi guys, happy Tuesday. I keep thinking it's Wednesday for some reason. Look at this, that's a great look. Um, Vlogmas day seven? Yeah, I'm a little dressed up today. I wish you could see my boots. Um, wearing some glammy earrings. Going to lunch with a male friend for his birthday. Um, no, it's not a romance. And yes, it's possible to have... I keep hearing things. I swear to God, I have ghosts. It is possible to uh, have male friends. And for some reason, I don't know. I can't seem to snag myself a relationship. But it's all good. Subconsciously, that's probably probably why I remain fat. It's almost like a barrier. I wrote a poem one time saying something like, My fat is, is soft armor to protect myself against your wolf stare. I used to exploit my body and how I perceived that I looked good when I was a younger woman. Um, and not really for sex, but like for attention, validation, acceptance, something that I would call love. Wow, I got into that real fast. Holy shit. So anyway, that's what I'm doing today. I'm going to lunch and I'm running errands. I'm finally going to CVS because I've got a prescription for my test strips um, called in. And I finally did my hair. I mean, I, I straightened it so that the bob would come out. I did some eyelashes again and it's been a while. Let me just go ahead and clean off this lens. Hold on. Am I still recording? Yes. Wait. I've only been talking for two minutes. Ah, uh, day two of no smoking. I feel like a strong bitch. I really do. I'm not quite sure if I was socially addicted to smoking or actually physically addicted. More of like a habit like a ritual. Whenever I would get a phone call, I, I would light a cigarette. Uh, when working on a poem, when talking about something uncomfortable with somebody, um, a lot of things would just trigger a need for a cigarette. But, you know, it could be an imaginary need, not an actual one. I keep looking over there because I'm waiting for him to get here. Um, so, yeah. This is Vlogmas, so I'm talking about kind of Christmassy things. Uh, I will go to CVS. I'm going to the dollar store to get more bows, boxes, and bags. Yay for alliteration. Um, when I go to CVS, I'm going to get a whole bunch of like flavored chapsticks, like lightly tinted, um, you know, like the little lip smackers, because I feel like those tucked into a makeup bag is a good... Not too sentimental, but still thoughtful gift for like co-workers. Um, as I said, a little gift and a card for my hairdresser, who's going to be dealing with all this gray. I swear, you guys, when I was doing my makeup this morning and when my hair was wet and it was all combed back, I couldn't believe the amount of grays. You know, you can fool yourself about aging all you want with makeup and with coloring your hair. But when you really realize that like if I went natural... I'd be probably 40% gray. I mean, I should just go for it. I should just embrace my age and, and be gray. It's not like it's ugly. You can tone it up and make it like a, like a lilac. These were a gift from someone. <laughs> They're long and dramatic even for me. They kind of like tickle my collarbone. So these are magnetic lashes. I put them on with one go. And I just felt like being a little dressed up today. This is a top from Venus, and I'm wearing black leggings uh, that have lace up the sides and kind of high boots, which I will show you. Let's see how I can do this. They have chains all over them. So yeah, all of these videos are going to wind up being like before looking videos because I'm determined to lose weight. I feel really strong about starting this even before the new year. Like I said yesterday, there's no time like the present. And I put down the bottle so I can put down the pack of cigarettes and I can put down the fork. Not as a deprivation or a punishment thing to myself, but just self-love. I ate dinner last night at work and I made sure I ate slowly and stopped when I was satisfied. Not full. He's late. And I'm really excited about my son coming over for dinner tonight. 
Um, that's awesome. I'm going to pick up, I'm going to make mashed potatoes, steamed broccoli, and pick up a big rotisserie chicken for him because that's what he likes. And uh, did I show you my tree yet? Here's kind of a mess, but here's a pile of presents so far. Small pile. I've got some other things over here. Uh, makes me feel very vulnerable to show you my mess, but you know. Where's my other parakeet? Are you down in the bottom? Oh, there they are. Sky and cloud, say hello. And let's go out and look at my tree. And pardon my forgetfulness. Somebody at work was kind enough to say it was because I got the vaccine. But, you know, that's sort of an anti-vax, fear-based um, opinion. I don't have to agree with everyone's opinion, but I do respect everyone's right to have one. Unless it's opinions about heinous things that are crimes. Anyway, here's my tree. Pretty cluttered looking, but cute. I only have about a quarter of my ornaments on it because it's small. It's like two and a half feet. And that's my outdoor wreath. And I think I showed you my indoor berry wreath. And uh, did I ever show you my walk-in closet, which is really my porch? It's for storage. And at the end there is where I do my makeup. Here's a bunch of clothes, all of which that don't fit in my only two closets that I have in my cottage. Here's about half of my shoes. I know it seems like I'm flexing or bragging or maybe I'm a little ashamed of all my stuff, but I do collect things. I'm a clutter bug and you would throw up if you saw my collection of makeup, which actually I should make it like a fun thing to organize it. It could be fun. I look really pale in this light. How's the makeup look today? I'm not fishing for a compliment. I'm fishing for advice, but I think I'm getting better at palettes and this is Too Faced gingerbread palette from last year actually. Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Medium and I tried to put another necklace on but with these talons I can't. Oops. I showed you my huge cocktail ring right from Romans. Oh that was just a finch at my bird feeder. Excuse me. I haven't eaten today. I took my meds and I took my vitamins and I'm drinking coffee. And I'm going to have something healthy with protein and vegetables for lunch. And I'm going to go now and I'll talk to you guys later. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Happy Hanukkah. Happy Kwanzaa. Happy winter solstice. You know, we're in the season. And I hope everyone finds reasons to be happy and grateful and to reach out to others today and, and love the people in your life. I keep a very small circle, but I love everybody. And... Um, yeah. So that's Vlogmas, Vlogmas <laughs> on this Tuesday morning. Talk to you later, guys. Peace. Oh, I didn't mention yesterday when I was rattling off when I was doing my makeup and I was rattling off all my mental illness diagnoses over the years. Um, I might have neglected to add that uh, I also was recently diagnosed ADHD. I think I have mentioned it, but that's why my brain is often very unfocused and all over the place and forgetful and I don't complete tasks assigned and I get very easily overwhelmed. Um, it's because I have ADHD. Oh, here comes my mail. No packages. He's cute. Oh my God. I love my mailman. Talk to you guys later. Love you.